I wonder whether you've ever asked for something, not really believing that you would get it. Maybe you wanted a puppy for your birthday, or maybe you've put a jet ski on your Christmas present wish list. You know you're not going to get a puppy because your parents have told you lots of times we're not having a dog. And you know that you're not really going to get a jet ski because they're so expensive and well, we don't live anywhere near the sea anyway. Well, in our Bible passage today from the book of Luke, we meet a man who didn't really believe he was going to get what he wanted. The man was called Zachariah. He was a priest, a good and godly man. And he was married to a lady called Elizabeth, who the Bible tells us was also good and godly. They loved each other, but they couldn't have a baby and they longed to have a baby. But as they got older, they didn't really believe it was possible for it to happen. Now, because Zachariah was a priest, he was asked to go into the temple to burn some incense. Burning incense is a little bit like lighting a candle. As the smoke from the incense goes up, the people watch the smoke and it was a little bit like them imagining their prayers going up to God in heaven. And they could picture their request going up to God. So Zachariah was in the temple burning the incense when suddenly a bright light appeared. Zachariah was terrified, stood next to him in the temple was an angel. The angel said to Zachariah, God has heard your prayer. Wow, Zachariah, uh, yes, a good and godly man, but he's been praying for so long. And here's an angel telling him that God has heard his prayer. The angel went on to say to Zachariah, you will have a baby. He's going to be a really special baby. You're to call him John and he will help people to learn all about Jesus and to get to know Jesus and better. And, and Zachariah reacted a little bit like you or I might if, you, if your, your mum or dad suddenly said you could have a puppy. You go, really? Zachariah was like, really? We're really going to have a baby? But, but, but that's, well, almost impossible because we're so old. But the angel said, I've been sent by God to tell you this, so you must believe it. Well, sure enough, later on, Elizabeth did become pregnant. And as soon as she realised she was pregnant, she thanked and praised God because she realised that God had heard her prayer and had made what seemed impossible become true. So I wonder as we think about this passage from the Bible, when we pray, do we really believe that God hears our prayers? Just like the angel told Zechariah that his prayers had been heard, do we know that God hears our prayers? And when we pray and if we think that God hears them, do we really believe that God is going to answer our prayers just as he did for Elizabeth and Zechariah, even when it seemed impossible? And when we realise that God has answered our, our prayers, do we do what Elizabeth did? Do we remember to thank and praise God, to give him the recognition that he has heard our prayers and he has answered them?